Hey guys, Steph here. So I made a bunch of videos a few days ago on my laptop and for some reason my laptop is acting up and giving me problems. So I'm going to do this quick video on here and hopefully it'll upload while I figure out what's going on with my laptop. I had some projects they finished. Um, I just have a haul but I have to see if I can even remember what I got and get everything back out. But um, So this is the stamp that I got from uh, Scrap and Stamper, she's here on YouTube. Her Etsy shop is not N-O-2, N-O-T, the number two, and Shabby, S-H-A-B-B-Y. She's got super cute stamps at great prices. So I used some My Mind's Eye paper on some dark brown cardstock, and I Copic colored her, I paper pieced her robe and slippers, stickled to the flowers, and used a white gel pen on her mug. And then I used a Fiskars uh, coffee and tea set stamp set for the Thanks a Latte and the uh, coffee beans here and on the border coffee beans there. I used a large brown acrylic flower from Beauty Bomb Bomb and some brown American Crafts ribbon. And on the inside, I just did Your Kindness Warms My Heart with some more coffee beans and the border of coffee beans. So, pretty simple, but I thought it turned out cute. And then I did a really super simple Get Well card uh, with my Lawn Fawn stamp set. And I just did um, white, black, and red cardstock. And I made a little pyramid of the soup bowls and stamped Get Well soon. So that one's super simple and two white brads. Then I did some layouts. Um, here's the first one of my father with my daughter and my niece. Um, I'm not going to go into all the products I used, but this one I mainly used scrap papers and, you know, a little Martha Stewart punch. And these are the Alpha stickers from Target. You get six for a dollar. And one of the Joby's flowers. So that's that one. And then this one is also um, my dad with my niece and my daughter. And I used some of the Studio D Brad. And then I forget where this Brad came from. And then I stamped Grandpa. And then I took off the dad part on this stamp and just put my hero. And you're not going to be able to see it, but on this tag here, I used that little dollar chevron stamp, and also on this tag. Sorry about the quality of this video. Okay, and then this one I had to cover because there are people in the photo I didn't get permission from to show on here. So this one is an ice cream layout. I used some Target washi tape and some uh, border punch. Some brads and buttons. Um, this is from Cat Scrappiness. Um, some stickers. This was also green. I just covered the top part in some pattern paper to make it look different. And then this one is a swimming one. I used the same blue um, sassafras paper in the back. And then I used this uh, clear acetate that has the colorful wavy lines on it. Uh, this wooden embellishment here, and this is a sticker, sticker, stickers, this is a wooden embellishment, and then I die cut a wave from pattern paper here and here, and stickled it, and then this is a pink paisley summer stamp, and then I made a tag with the date and just journaled on here. So that is the projects I've done so far. Um, hopefully I'll be able to get my laptop fixed, and um, get my other videos uploaded. If not, I'll be doing it again on here. I, you know, craziness, but anyway, <laughs> I just wanted to share that with you guys. So check out um, Scrab and Stamper here on YouTube and her Etsy shop, Not Too Shabby. All right. Thanks a bunch for watching. Bye, guys.